Hello and welcome to Cracking the Cryptic. Um, now, not so debuts today. What you may not know if you've joined the channel in the past couple of weeks is that my kind of first love was crosswords. Now, for me, that means cryptic crosswords, but the other style of crosswords, um, Ameri US style crosswords, American crosswords, um, has an annual tournament called the ACPT, the American Crossword Puzzle Tournament, which takes place every year in Connecticut and happened this last weekend. Um, we can see on the screen a clip from the final where the three best solvers from seven rounds of the competition um, go on stage and try and solve the final clues which they have to hold in their hand on huge whiteboards um, for the for the amusement of a crowd of a few hundred people. And uh, I've been to the ACPT, it's great fun. Um, and I love the fact that they make some theater out of it. In our cryptic crosswords finals at the Times Crossword Championship, we don't have anything like that. Now, when I've been to the American tournament, um, it's been borne in on me that my skill at cryptic crosswords doesn't translate. Um, these guys that you see here have so much more experience than me, as do many of the competitors there. So this year I've had a go at the seven qualifying puzzles um, and then compared my times to the times of those people who were at the event. And had I been there, it seems I would have come 80th equal. So 79 people quicker than me. That's fine. Um, I was very happy to be in the top 100. That indicated that I didn't make a mistake in any of the puzzles, which is quite unusual, given the um, especially US references and some of the proper nouns. I would expect to make one mistake over the course of the American tournament. But that position of 80th means that I wouldn't be in the top three by miles and miles and miles. So these guys are way better than me. However, I do like to attempt the final puzzle and to try and do it in the maximum 15 minutes that they get on stage, unless it's 20, I think it's 15. But um, that's what I'm gonna try and have a go at now. Um, I've got the puzzle, I haven't tried it, and there is a fair chance that this video will begin with five or 10 minutes of me barely getting any entries. So that could be a bit dull. Feel free to kind of skip ahead to where I get some if that follows the kind of form of past years. So I'm going to have a look at the puzzle now, and I will put up a timer as well so that uh, you can see the seconds ticking by as well. So here's the puzzle, and off we go. Right, one across. Kid Rock. don't know what that means. Former capital of Belgium. Two down, says C. Blurb. There's a little bit of up here for anyone who can't complete this puzzle. Robin, the setter, says two down. Don't know what that is. Three, remove grime from, in a way, quite a long answer. Four, no, I'm going to really have to find something that I know. Fifteen, ready for bed, within. Um, turn in, that can't be ready for bed as a transitive verb. Six down, electrical, all right. Seven, eight, brilliant firework, and that's nine letters. Oh, I don't know. Nine, vigilant. Eleven, rigging need for Peter Pan or Mary Poppins. Rigging need, run? That's surely for climbing a ship or something. That's very odd. If that was run, nine, dang, that's good. Ooh, could be a phrase. 16, green, naive. Would 12 down have a V? Certain betting line fuses, gels. 18 across, ending in L. Having a silver lining, but question mark. The question mark can mean, oh, so-called whales. So killer whales aren't really, oh, Tiger sharks? Oh, I 
don't know, they would fit. Rijksmuseum painter, that could be Franz Hals. He's a four-letter painter, especially if, yeah, 29, ac oops, sorry, 29 across is a plural, so shocks, jolts, or could be something for haircuts, afros. Standard campaign topic. Jobs. Okay, let's go with jobs and jobs. Um, we are working on the A clues, the hardest clues. There are other B and C clues available, but it's fun to try. Singleton for one. Suit holding. 36. Try something new, beginning with a B. Break. Mm, could be. 23 down hoax with a T in it. <sighs> 33. Mondelez International Snack. Well, I'm going with Oreo because it's such a, it is a snack. It's such a popular crossword ease word. 24. Shell found in a lake. Uh, I don't know. 23 down, hoax. Oh, put on to hoax someone, I suppose. Let's go with that. 24, so the shell found in a lake has got a U in it. 22, confab. Um, that's a, it's just a chat, isn't it? A, oof, two down, uh, for anyone who can't complete this puzzle. Could they put it in sorry? 36 across, try something new. Bring something. Brand. And then 39 beginning with a Y. Singleton for one. Sis. It's a system. Is three down a plural? No. Clean. Could, could end in clean, three down. Let's try that. Singleton be S Y N. So shell found lake could be a skull because that can be a type of boat. Five down. I mean, I'm not certain about any of this. I think this will end in sorry. One across. Fourteen. Enjoy special. Right, let's keep guys. Got to help to start words. So thirty-seven, thirty-six. Try something new. Brand. Oh, if you do, if you try a new product, are you brand swapping or something? 37, sweets, dulcets, dragays, <sighs> little bundles of energy, 40 across, 42. Now I know better, but mm, eat, pray, love, destination, 42 down. don't know what that means. Oh, it's from the film, but. 46, something lab. Could be meth. 47, can you dig it? Yard? No. Could be. 55, classic roadrunner scenery. It's always in canyons, mesas, maybe. Farm lab? No. 52, Carl's Love in Up. I haven't seen it. That's not going to work. 46, they're really bright and people look up to them. Shining stars or something? 50, so... <laughs> what a clue. What was 21 beginning with H? So-called whales beginning with H. Oh, see, five, six minutes in, haven't really got much done here. Remove grime from steam clean. Wow, the M would fit with PA. Confab. Compassionate. Companion. Mm, I bet it begins compa. Former capital of Belgium. Oh, it's not the city type of capital. It's money, so it's a Belgian franc. Kid Rock. Enjoy special status rate. That could be. 17. One-time competitor of the NYSE, so it's an exchange. Is it called 
Amex. Yeah, I think it is. It could be I am so sorry. 20 down. I'm in the puzzle palace. I don't know. Let's go with I am so sorry as Robin's apology. Four down. Title character. Kid. It is great, I think. Title character. Tex. Fist. Kid could be the name of a boxer. Rock, I suppose, his hand. Ooh, no idea. Could be fist. Five down. No shrinking violet. She, some sort of... Oh, um... Not an it girl. Some sort of girl, isn't it? Riot girl or something. I think it is some sort of girl. So the confab is a comparison... Com Confab. Compart? Wow, I just don't know. With all six letters at the beginning of it, 21. So-called whales. Ah, oh, some sort of sharks, surely. 18. Having a silver lining. Grey-haired? Maybe, like, silver surfers. The sister of Nephthys. Rhea? No, a surge at six down would be an electrical worry. Isis? And an it girl? Ready for bed. To tuck someone in is to ready them for bed. It girl. She's no shrinking violet. That's probably true. Seven down, famous corporate raider, Carl, oh, Carl Icahn, and of course, grey-haired in the American spelling, I have to remember that, is with an A, might still not be grey-haired, but looks like Isis now at five across, eight down, oh, skyrocket, presumably, and to confab must be a verb to compare notes, so, 21, so-called whales, high rollers, are they called whales in casinos? Maybe. Um, 19 down, hot, if the H from head is right. More in, hotter, that'll do. 25, Lincoln or Kennedy Center. 9 down, vigilant, on alert, probably. Ten um, precipitates in a way hails. Eleven rigging need. I, what the heck is that wire? Oh, to to for, to play them in a play or something. Dang, that's good. Could be oh wow, and then green is naive. We get over and. Weds at 12 and 13. I don't know why a betting line is over, but fuses could be weds. Okay, half of it done in 10 minutes. That's something. View from Squaw Valley. Well, it must be Lake Tahoe. Let's go with that. I don't know for sure, but it's a noted American lake. 34, temperate, sober. Yeah, I like that. Uh, 31 down. The Thief of Baghdad. Abu is the monkey, surely. Branch out rather than brand swap, okay. 30 down, beginning loo. Phrase that originated on a World War II. Look sharp, look smart. On a World War II propaganda poster. 34, con man. Oh, this is one of those words, a shaker or a shill or a sh... Ah. 37 beginning with C. Sweets now begins with C. Candies? What would 40 be? Little bundles of energy. What the heck is that? Well, maybe it's not look. Little loose, loose lips sink ships. That will have been off a poster. 
Um, let's try candies. I don't really have any evidence for that apart from one clue. Carl's love, no. 55 Roadrunner scenery. Mises would work, but it's wild guess at the moment. 42, something and something. Now I know better, but once bitten? Yeah, I look, once feels good. 46 across. They're really bright and people look up to them. Something lamps? Could be. 43, knight or bishop? Surely that's a piece, a chess piece? <clears throat> or oh, someone telling a tale in the Canterbury Tales? Peace. Could 53 be in PC? No, not wing it. I'm confident about loose lips, much more than about candies, strangely. 32. Believed unquestionably. Ah, good thing to have when you're out for the night. Must mean asleep rather than partying. 28. Sinks. Sets. The sun sinks. It sets, maybe. 26. Rulers' divisions. Um, centimetres, probably. CMs. 26 down. Wise offering. There might be somebody called Wise that I can't think of. Setting for the Bond film Goldeneye. Montenegro. Is that the one in Montenegro? I think it is. That helps me that Indi England were playing Montenegro the other night at football. Good thing to have when you're out for the night. Uh, don't know. 38, red side. Red side. That's probably a side dish of beets. How about that? 38 down with a the barbershop regular bass from the singing, I suppose. 41, root. Mm. 32, believed unquestionably, ate it. Ate up. If you, yeah, I like that. 41, root. Ooh. That doesn't look so good. What was 42? Now I know better, but once I was... Well, maybe not the P then. Damn. 35. Good thing to have when you're out for the night is a tent. Um, 26. Wise offering cheese. Cheese? Probably is. 41. Root. Cause. Um, and now I see we're coming up to 15 minutes so if that is the time limit and I think it may well be this is where I've got to <clears throat> let's keep going though see how we do 49 cry from a field meh bar mu no first name in sp first first name in space Yuri Gagarin? No. Oh, I don't know. Address? I'm sure that it's Montenegro. I'm sure there's a Bond film made there. Could be Monte Carlo, though, couldn't it? Ah! Damn. So, 42. Now I know better, but once... Suspect or something. So the cry from field could be ma or bar. What was 26? Wise offering. Could be a cheese ball. That would work. What was 54? No, addresses must be URLs. They're not GPS friendly. 57. With 45 down, it's a surprise. Dark horse. But then it couldn't be Monte Carlo. Uh, 51, right, oh, 49, oh, M or B, cheese, ah, oh, 51, first, first name in space, oh, Yuri now, I wanted it to be Neil or Yuri, 
Righto, yup. Plot twist is a surprise. Okay, that's nice. Um, cheese curl and a core from a crow or something in a field. Now I know better, but suspect or respect? 41 down. Long straight sided cigar. Cubano? I know a few words for cigars, but I don't know. normally be able to see. Cheroot 50. So, what if it is? Could be. Or what if I did? Um, 34 down with con man ending in an F. Ooh, I think I may have gone a step too far here. Uh, I don't, I'm not trusting what if it is or what if I did. That That's a bit too random. for. So, um, 40 was little bundles of energy. AA for the batteries. So the con man could be a shader or a shaker. Oh, once, now I know better, but in retrospect, that fits. Crikey. 43, knight or bishop, beginning with a T. That's unexpected. 44, magnificent regal. Let's go with that. Could be royal, but regal feels good. 53 across, not wing it. Plan. So, how about this so... No, I don't know. That's Cohiba, actually. Would be a cigar, but it doesn't fit anymore. Woman's name meaning rock in Hebrew. Well, Sela is a name. Title for knight or bishop, maybe. Let's go with Sela. 46. They're really bright and people look up to them. Sharky, 50, so, must be a go, must be Corona for the cigar, 46, they're really bright and people look up to them, what could that be, flyers, chandeliers, well, there's a lot of lights in the ceiling, Okay, 46, Crim Lab. 47, can you dig it? Some sort of soil, but beginning with H, I don't know. Craft store stock. Arts? No. 42, eat, pray, love, destination could well be India. On the basis, not many other things would fit. Carl's love, ugh. Classic road says could still be Mises Crim. So, how did it go? Yeah, that fits. How did it go? Chem lab, I think that's an American term. Um, can you dig it a hole? It is Mises, and this is alls for doing holes and things. There we are, just under 20 minutes. I think this is right. Now, the letter I would be most concerned about being wrong is this one in fist and text. But if I'm honest, there could be other mistakes elsewhere. I think that's the answer, though, in just under 20 minutes. And, you know, it's not a great performance. There's there's three guys, and do track down the video of... Uh, the winner, Dan Fair, and also June Park and uh, Howard Plotkin solving it because they're amazing solvers. And uh, I'm going to have a look at that now. I didn't want to look at it before doing this because uh, that would be kind of getting some ins on the answers. But I have no doubt that when one watches them, one will be saying with nine across, oh, wow. So uh, thanks very much for watching my effort at the final puzzle in this year's um, American Crossword Puzzle Tournament. And uh, I hope 
you were good at that and I'm sure you were shouting some answers at it when I wasn't getting them. So thanks for watching. Hope to see you again on Cracking the Cryptic. Um, the software we were using here was Sympathy for the Grid and then Simon had written out the clues for me. So that's just from Word. And uh, see you again sometime. Bye for now.